dear students today we shall start the 31 number video that means 30 first video up to 30 number video it was given today we shall solve some problems by using first shifting theorem so let us consider this example find the inverse laplace transform of the following number 1 1 by s minus 2 whole square plus 1 number 2 s minus 1 by s minus 1 whole square plus 4 Number 3, 1 by s plus 3 whole square minus 4. Number 4, s plus 2 by s plus 2 whole square minus 25. First, we consider number 1. In number 1, 1 by s minus 2 whole square plus 1. This one. This is number 1. Now, we know the first shifting property. If L inverse f is equal to f t, then L inverse f s plus a equal to e to the power minus a t L inverse f s. So if we remove this a, this a becomes here. Same formula, same property we can write in this way also. f of s minus a. So if it is minus, then this will be plus. Same formula. So f of s. Same property we can write in this way. If it is plus, then here we get minus. This power a becomes in power of e and f this fs l inverse fs and this is minus then this is a t and l inverse fs this now we want to remove this two if we want to remove this two then e to the power this is minus this will be plus twice t l inverse one by s square plus one we get this one if we remove this two then we get this and this is our direct formula 1 by s square plus 1 square, 1 means 1 square, then this is sine a t, a means 1 t, and this is our answer. Next we consider number 2, number 2, L inverse s minus 1 by s minus 1 whole square plus 4, this is number 2. Now from this we want to remove this one, by using this, this property. If we remove a, then e to the power at l inverse fs, this. So we remove 1, then e to the power 1 t l inverse s by s square plus 4, this. So we get this, e to the power t l inverse s by s square plus 4 means 2 square. Again, I recall the formula, l inverse s by s square plus a square this equal to numerator is s this is cos cos a t so here also numerator s this will be cos a t a means 2 2 t so this is our answer next we consider third number we consider problem number 3 so again we remove this 3 s plus 3 if s plus a then e to the power minus a t if we remove this 3, then e to the power minus 3t, L inverse 1 by s square minus 4, we get this one. Now, e to the power minus 3t, L inverse, this is s square minus 2 square, 4 means 2 square. Now, we write down numerator is 2, and here 1 by 2, 2 to cancel, ultimately we get our previous term. So, there is students, denominator is minus Denominator of minus means this is nothing but our hyperbolic function. So I recall the formula L inverse A by S square minus A square. This is sign hyperbolic A T, this formula. So same formula we can use here. This is e to the power 3t by 2. Then this whole we can write sign hyperbolic A T. A means twice t. And this is our answer. And number 4 we consider L inverse S plus 2 by S plus 2 whole square minus 25. This one. So we want to solve this problem. Again we get S plus 2, S plus 2. We want to remove this 2. If we remove this 2, the same formula. This formula. S plus A, e to the power minus AT, L inverse FS. So we, if we remove this 2, e to the power minus twice T. L inverse S by S square and 25 means 5 square. 
again you get denominator minus if denominator minus then hyperbolic but numerator is s this is cos so i recall the formula l inverse s by s square minus a square this will be cos hyperbolic at so this will be e to the power minus twice t cos hyperbolic 5t and this is our answer next we consider another example so we consider this example find the inverse laplace transform of twice s minus 5 by 9 s square minus 25 now we want to solve this problem in this problem l inverse twice s minus 5 by 9 s square minus 25 this one now we separate this twice s by 9 s square minus 25 twice s by we separate this twice s by 9 s square minus 25 minus 5 by 9 s square minus 25 now we taking l inverse with this here and here also we taking l inverse this one and l inverse 5 by 9 s square minus 25 now we know this formula l inverse s by s square minus a square this is cos hyperbolic a t l, l inverse a by s square minus a square this is sin hyperbolic a t now in this problem the coefficient of s square is 1 coefficient of s square is 1 all the problems we have coefficient of s square is 1 now here coefficient given 9 here also 9 we remove this line 9 we remove this so this is 9 common and s square minus 25 by 9 we can write this and here also we are taking 9 common then s square minus 25 by 9 this one we get so dear students this line is, is clear just all the formula we have coefficient of s square is 1 but here you get coefficient of s square is 9 here also 9 taking 9 is common then 2 by 9 taking outside l inverse s by s square 5 by 3 whole square this will be 25 by 9 so here 5 by 9 taking outside l inverse 1 by s square minus 5 by 3 whole square so this is s by s square minus a square this formula s by s square minus a square this is cos hyperbolic at t so this will be cos hyperbolic 5 by 3 t now 5 by 9 remains same now in this problem this is a by s square minus a square but a is at same so we write numerator is 5 by 3 and denominator s square 5 by 3 whole square and this is 5 by 3 here we write 3 by 3 by 5 then this will be cancelled ultimately get 1 so this one we get now 2 by 9 cos hyperbolic 5 by 3 t this 3 3 cancel this 5 5 cancel 1 by 3 a by s square minus a square a by s square minus a sin hyperbolic at t this is sin hyperbolic 5 by 3 t so dear student this solution is clear and if this is clear then this is our answer let us consider this example find l inverse s square plus twice s plus 6 by s cube now we want to solve this problem l inverse s square plus twice s plus 6 by s cube this one given this is very easy problem solution also very easy uh, no one can say this solution is difficult i can challenge this with the students no one can say this solution is difficult this solution is very easy so this is cancelling 1 by s 2 by s square 6 by s cube so taking l inverse l inverse 1 by s plus 2 taking outside l inverse 1 by s square 6 taking outside l inverse 1 by s cube so we write in this way but we know this formula 
n inverse 1 by s to the power n this is t to the power n minus 1 by factorial n minus 1 it was given in last video so this is our formula and again you know l inverse 1 by s means 1 so l inverse 1 by s means 1 this is 1 2 1 by s to the power n this formula n means 2 then t to the power 2 minus 1 2 minus 1 this is t to the power 2 minus 1 by factorial 2 minus 1 and here n means 3 using this formula t to the power 3 minus 1 by factorial 3 minus 1 so 1 plus 2t by factorial 1 6t square by factorial 2 1 plus twice t 6t square factorial 2 means 2 into 1 so 1 plus twice t plus this is cancel 3t square and this is our big answer big answer represent this this is the ending ceremony so there are students whether the solution is difficult or easy if it is easy then please subscribe to my channel and like this video if it is difficult then write in comment box thanks